the fact that I get to sit down and share with you guys my view on film, fashion, and photography is pretty crazy. Today we talk in fashion. If this is your first time tuning in here on this channel, we talk about film, fashion, and photography, all three things that I love. Uh, and today I get an opportunity to be able to share with you guys some of the three things uh, that I picked out. Now, um, one of these items is no longer on Zara.com and it's kind of weird because I've seen this happen before. I'll order uh, an item or a piece of clothing uh, a couple weeks prior to doing a, vi a video and then it will disappear off the website. Now, I don't think that it went on sale. This jacket is really, really cool, but the jacket that I'm talking about is the Patch Bomber jacket. Now. I'm still going to include this in the review, but keep in mind that this jacket may or may not appear on Zara.com anymore, especially at the you know, recording of this video. But I'll make sure to include it and also some comparable uh, items that are very similar to the one that I reviewed. But first, let's look at the bomber jacket. This bomber jacket is pretty cool. I got one gripe about this jacket, but we'll get to that in here in a second. This jacket is made out of polyester and polyurethane, primarily the sleeves of polyurethane and the rest of the jacket is polyester. So don't expect for this joint to keep you warm, but it is you know, roomy enough for you to be able to add layers to it. So if it was me wearing this jacket, I would definitely throw in, throw under a, you know, a short sleeve, long sleeve. You can even throw under a thick sweater because it has enough room. I like my clothes to fit a lot more slim uh, but this one was okay this was like a regular fit uh, true to size i would say uh, i bought this in a small and it fit and i still had room to be able to you know maneuver and move around it didn't feel restrictive or tight or um, it, it felt really good so this is definitely one that if you are in a season where you are looking to order a jockey type you know old school looking jacket like this one i would definitely pick this one up uh, again, this jacket may or may not be on uh, Zara.com's website, but I'll make sure to link similar items around the same price, meaning hopefully around the same quality as well, but just keep in mind that I did not review those. Moving on to the next one, we have a puffer jacket, burgundy color. Right now, I believe it is on sale for $39.99. Now this jacket was originally priced at like 70 bucks. It is on sale right now. I believe it comes in a green, a black, and a burgundy. I ordered, I ordered the burgundy because, I don't know, I felt like that color was one that I did not have in my arsenal, but also I didn't have a puffer jacket either. You know, I, again, my style was pretty slim for the most part. I wear you know, slimmer clothes, my jackets. You know, some people may say I, uh, they fit a little bit too tight, but I wanted to kind of step outside of just the slim look and just kind of get a puffer jacket that was a little that was a little bit more bulky um, a little bit more uh, outside of my wheelhouse and it felt good i think this is a jacket that especially for 40 bucks right now especially that we are tapering off on the winter season this is a good jacket to buy um, and then hold on to for the, for the next um, winter season fall season or what have you so um, when it comes to layering it, you can definitely throw a hoodie, you know, sweater, anything to thicken it up. Again, this jacket is made at 100% polyester all the way through. Through and through, this thing is polyestered out. It is not going to keep you warm, so you definitely need to layer it. But overall, this is a pretty decent jacket. And again, I believe it comes in black, burgundy, and another color as well. Uh, I'll make sure to put a link in the description for you to check it out. Moving on to the last and final item that I ordered. Now this one is not considered a jacket by any means on Zara.com. However, it is uh, and feels like a jacket. Uh, it, it, it's big enough, it's roomy enough, it's a nice green. I think what really attracted me to this particular overshirt, uh, cause that's what it's named, it's fleece overshirt uh, in green. Uh, I think it's because it looked like a winter jacket, uh, a winter overshirt. I always enjoy those items that look like you're supposed to wear them in the winter time. And it looks like it's made out of wool. Um, I can't remember off the top of my head what it's made from right now, but I do remember that it felt heavy and it felt roomy. Uh, one of the things about the sizes is that it is small to medium, 
right? So there are no individual sizes. There's no small, medium, large, extra large. The way that this overshirt, I want to call it a jacket so bad, uh, but the way that this overshirt fits is, uh, or the way that they sized it, small to medium is really all in one overshirt jacket. Um, and if you wear a medium, you wear a medium to large. Uh, so if you do plan on ordering this right now, it is twenty five ninety nine on Zara.com. And it also comes in a like a stone white color. The pocket is a little lower um, on the white on the white one. But I believe that one's full price right now. Uh, if you really, really like this particular jacket, I would definitely order it because it does feel heavy. It doesn't feel cheap. I think Zara did a really good job with making this one. Uh, a lot of times you'll see clothing brands uh, like Zara. Uh, this is no shade, but sometimes some particular jackets just feel cheap. But Zara did a really good job with this one. And I would definitely recommend ordering this one, especially if you're into the green one that you see here. Uh, it is $25.99, which is crazy, but they're going fast. So I would get over there soon if you see the video. But anyways, um, again, sometimes I'm a, I notice that I'm a review close and they're not always going to be available when I put the video out. So I do apologize about that. I'm going to try to put out videos much faster, or I'm going to try to hop on new items as they appear on the website. So that way it gives me enough of time to be able to shoot the video, do B roll, all that good jazz and, um, upload it in time for y'all to see it, consider buying it, whatever the case is. And that pretty much does it. This is my first review. This is crazy. Um, I'm still working out the kinks on like how to review clothes and how to go about doing it. So bear with me y'all. Anyways, that does it for me. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, again, this year is about being consistent, staying disciplined, uploading, really just showing up for me. So um, I appreciate you guys listening. As always, uh, my name is David Wilson, the second. And as always, start your day with giving because way too many people take. Sign up.